ever paused to consider what hemodialysis is and why it's so crucial in healthcare? Well, hemodialysis is a life-saving medical procedure that steps in when the kidneys can't. It's the hero that removes waste and excess fluids from the blood. Let's delve into the process step by step. First, a vascular access point is created, usually through an arteriovenous fistula, arteriovenous graft, or central venous catheter. This is the gateway for blood to travel from the patient's body to the dialysis machine. Next, the blood embarks on its journey, pumped through tubing into the dialysis machine, where it meets the dialyzer, our artificial kidney. The dialyzer houses a semi-permeable membrane that opens the door for waste products and excess fluids to exit the bloodstream. Running parallel to this, a dialysis solution, a mimic of blood minus the waste products, flows on the other side of the membrane. This sets the stage for the exchange of substances between the blood and the dialysate. Then, the dialyzer springs into action. It filters waste products, excess fluids, and electrolytes from the blood into the dialysate, acting as a purifier. Following filtration, the now cleaned blood is returned to the patient's body, much like a homeward journey after a thorough cleanse. Throughout this process, vital signs and other parameters are closely monitored to ensure the patient's safety. Hemodialysis operates on three working principles. There's diffusion, where waste products move from a higher concentration in the blood to a lower concentration in the dialysate. There's ultrafiltration, which removes excess fluids by creating a pressure gradient. And there's convection, where the convective flow of dialysate aids in fluid and solute removal. Hemodialysis is a beacon of hope for those with end-stage renal disease, stepping in when kidney function has severely declined. It offers several benefits, including the elimination of waste, maintaining fluid balance, and restoring the balance of electrolytes. However, it's not without its risks. These can include hypotension, muscle cramps, infection, blood clotting, and the potential transmission of hepatitis B and C if equipment isn't properly sterilized. Remember, while hemodialysis is a lifesaver, it's not a cure for kidney disease. Patients often require regular, ongoing sessions to maintain health. The type of dialysis chosen depends on the patient's individual factors and preferences. Regular medical follow-ups and adherence to prescribed treatments are key for successful outcomes. So the next time you hear the term hemodialysis, you'll know the intricate steps at play, its benefits and the risks involved. It truly is a remarkable process, wouldn't you agree?